She's my champion. Aremu Afolaye knocks you the duche over Funke Akindele. On before this one. Regina Chuku and Mobimpe sets the internet on fire as the mag bendy in glam style. But before we proceed, welcome to Orange's TV, a platform where we give you latest and trending news happening all over the world of social media. If you have not already, do subscribe to our channel and don't forget to like, share, turn on the notification bell to get notified anytime we drop a new video. And for all our subscribers, much love from us to you guys. Thank you so much for always staying tuned. And for all our viewers out there, feel relaxed and enjoy. Yoruba actor Haremu Afolaye has reacted to the post of his colleague Yule Doche admonishing Funke Akindele over her electoral loss. Haremu Afolaye shared a caption of Yule Doche's message to Funke Akindele, urging her to wear her scar with pride. Yule's message came after the multiple award winning actress deleted her campaign post on social media. Sharing Yule's message on Instagram, Haremu Afolaye claimed Funke Akindele is his champion. She's my champ, he said. It was reported that former presidential aspirant Yu Ledoche penned a deep message to encourage Funka Akindele after her loss at the just concluded gubernatorial election in Nigeria. Yu Ledoche shared a photo of Funka Akindele online, advising her to return the deleted photos to her page. He claimed the photos would serve as a reminder of her success and scar in battle. According to the father of five, Funka Akindele's name on the ballot is a feat which many who mocked her have dreamed of achieving. Hours ago, it was reported that Funke Akindele started a new beginning by deleting her Instagram memories. The record breaking, Funke Akindele first deleted the People Democratic Party campaign videos and photos from her Instagram page before removing those of her husband and project. Only five posts are left on her page, including a tribute to her late mother, an official statement on her next move post-election failure, her record-breaking posts and others. Sandy Ali stared emotional as he pays tributes to Funke Akindele. Tonto DK bowed to her colleague Funke Akindele following their loss in the gubernatorial elections. In her lengthy message, she acknowledged Funke Akindele's courage in accepting the offer of a deputy gubernatorial candidate in Lagos State. The mother of one disclosed that she knows how difficult it is to participate in politics, hence encouraging women to take their stand and support one another. She said, I would love to give Funke Akindele her flower for standing up for Lagos State for me. It has always been about integrity, not party. As a woman, I know firsthand how difficult it can be to participate in politics, but I urge my fellow women not to be discouraged. Instead, let us support each other, regardless of political affiliation. Also, I know I may have offended some people during this course, hence I ask for forgiveness. Moving on to the next one. Finally, the D day for Nollywood actresses Adebimpe Oyebade, better known as Mobimpe, and Regina Chuku is here. The wife of Latif Ade Dimeji and the mother of two have been eagerly counting down to their birthday since the beginning of the month. Taken to their respective Instagram pages, the celebrants shared glamorous photos to mark their new age. Mobimpe and Regina's birthday dresses look quite similar but with different colors. Why Mobimpe clocked 29 today, Regina Chuku clocks 43. On her part, Mobimpe appreciated all the brands who worked with her for her birthday shoots. She said, Happy birthday, Adebimpe Omo Oba. Road to 23 loaded. Thank you, Lord. A big thank you to all the brands who worked with me on this year Road to 23 shoots. Regina Chuku, on her own part, is said to pressure the internet with her birthday photos. Shall we begin? She said. Is what Gina's day? Are you guys ever ready? Cause na move you. It was recorded that last year Regina Chuku and Mobipe broke the internet with their birthday photos. The actresses had tensioned fans with jaw dropping photos of themselves. Sharing a video of herself dancing, Regina revealed that her birthday photos was drop dead gorgeous as her glam squad went all out for her. Mobipe also took to her Instagram page to reveal that she couldn't keep calm knowing her birthday was in the next 11 hours. At first, the two seemed to be shunning each other's belly, but Mobipe bowed pressure as she celebrated Regina. Mobimpe not only took to the comment section of Regina to drop a sweet birthday comment, but she also reported her photos on her Instagram page. Responding to one of Regina's stunning photos on Instagram, she commented with, Beautiful sweet sister, love you mama. Also taken to her Instagram page, the wife of Latif Adedimeji gushed over Regina and described her as a sexy, beautiful birthday mate. Showing that there was no enmity between them, Regina Chuku also took to her comment section to profess her love for her. Regina Chuku affirmed that she loved Mobimpe more than she could think. 
Reminiscing on her past year, she said, Last year, I celebrated my birthday in a rented apartment, but today, I am landlord in this city I was born and raised in. God has been so intentional about me and I do not take it for granted. The mother of two took to her Instagram page to narrate how difficult life was for her as a single mother following the death of her husband and the father of her kids. Regina recounted how she had to move into her father's house following her husband's death because she couldn't afford rent. She revealed that she had to manage under the same room with her many kids and parents, had to sleep outside with her mosquito nets and move. However, today her story has changed and God has blessed her and her kids with a house of their own. So guys, I would like you to hit the comment section. Let us know what you think about this. And let us know what you feel about this. See you guys next time in my next video. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel.